What up bros, Brand back with another video. Today I want to show you guys how I am currently testing my DPS and working on improving my rotation as a sharpshooter uh, for the content up ahead. So to do so, we are going to head off to Trixian. We're going to talk to Beatrice. She's going to allow us to go to the training grounds. We enter the training grounds. And this is where we're gonna allow this is going to allow us to manipulate either our stats or our engravings or just test on purely what we have equipped, which is what I'm going to do today. So let me explain how you would set this up. First of all, we need a target dummy. That's gonna be a scarecrow on boss. So we come here, monster, we change it to scarecrow, change it to boss, and we summon. See, this is gonna be our target dummy here. This is what we're gonna attack to test our DPS. Now, if you want to test different stat setups and different engraving setups, you can do so. And that's going to be up here at the top right. We have stats, top right. You can go ahead and put in any stats you want. You could go ahead and type in like, a, you know, 1200 crit, 300 spec, which is about what I'm at right here. And you would save that. And then you would hit service stats. You switch it from equipped stats to service stats and then hit go. And then it's going to put me exactly at that 1200, 300. But if we, if we switch it back to equipped stats and hit go again, then it's going to put us back to what we actually have equipped. And now you can do the exact same thing with engravings. Um, you come over here and you can, you know, set up your Death Strike 3, um, grab your Grudge, and then maybe maybe you want to compare. Maybe you want to compare your third engraving. Maybe you want to see what Keen Blunt looks like versus um, Cursed All. You could do that. You just come in here and you can choose any of the engravings you want. So you could do something like that, save it. Switch it to engraved services, hit go, and now all of a sudden you're rocking Grudge, Cursed All, Death Strike. Test it for a few trials, then switch the Cursed All to Keen Blunt, and then compare them side by side and see which one you think is looking better. Uh, but for this test, we're just going to do what I have e equipped, which is going to be just Death Strike 3, Grudge 3, and Raid Captain 1, which uh, unfortunately isn't really doing much for us here because I don't have a lot of bonus movement speed. I don't really have any swiftness. Um, but it's better than nothing. Basically just getting it from my stone. Um, it's a Grudge 8, Raid Captain 4 stone. So we just have Raid Captain 1 somewhere. There it is right there, Raid Captain 1, which is just giving us a little bit of damage. Not much at all, though. And for gems, we're rocking a uh, um, pretty nice setup for gems, actually. We got this is the full BIS setup that I want in endgame, just not ranked up super high yet. So we're just rocking our main burst setup, Snipe, Charge Shot. Um, arrow wave and sharpshooter all with plus damage and uh, minus cooldown and then we got same thing for blade storm um, plus damage minus cooldown and atomic arrow we got a little bit of damage on that and for the build i just recently got over that little hump of 340 points which is going to allow us to get our atomic arrow to 10 and grab long fuse which is in insane power spike um, 75 percent bonus damage on our atomic arrow is crazy to do that from my last video, I was running like a 7-7 here, like this, I believe is what I was running before. So once we hit the 340, you drop moving slash down to 4, and you bump that atomic arrow up to 10 and grab that long fuse, right? So let's go ahead and get into the tests. So for the tests, I just want to reiterate, we're running uh, the just my default equip stats, equipped engravings which we went over, Monsters on Scarecrow and Boss. We're going to set the battle time to one minute. And we're going to start with a full meter. That's what I like to do. All right, let's get into it.